to explain. He won't explain. Why would you lead someone on? Why would you? Um, he won't what? explain. He won't. He will not explain. We have dreams. He will not explain. We have dreams. We have promises. We have all of that. And it's like, Seema, how do you? How? Why? How many times is this gonna happen? Obuti, okay, I meet someone, we kick it, everything is cool. Let's go do that then. And then he's like, Abba, Abba, and then he switch up. And then he's, after I put so much effort into the, after, you know, okay, why? At the Sasmas, yeah? the Sasmas, Sima was there, I was there with Ghost. And then I'm like, you know what, nah, go talk to your bestie, like it's cool, I'm not jealous about it or whatever, like, or whatever. So now they're chatting it up, and then Sima comes and she hugs me. And I'm like, oh my god, she smells so nice, wara wara wara. Jay Amora hopped into Instagram Live crying over her breakup with ex Ghost Luby. According to Jay, Ghost Luby reconciled with ex lover Sima. From the video, Jay feel blindsided and betrayed. While this is happening, Ghost Luby and Sima seem to be spending a lot of time together as seen on the pictures. The two are back at it with the social media content. This story had social media buzzing with fans wondering if this was a prank and was made for views. From Jay's video her emotions seems real but you can never be too sure. This is how some fans reacted, one wrote I am disappointed in Seema for choosing to go back to being content for Ghost Luby. When he said, she is the best girlfriend he had ever had, what he actually meant is that she generates more YouTube views for him than any other girl he has ever had. And I couldn't agree with this statement more. Their relationship is way publicized and I think it will definitely lead to their demise. They just got back together and they have already shared too much content than necessary. I understand them being content creators but where are boundaries? If you two broke up before, why not nurture the relationship first and protect it before you run and tell the public about it? I personally don't believe in rekindling a failed relationship because it failed for a reason the first time. But I'm not going to hate on their relationship, who knows perhaps they can make it work. The fact of the matter is they're young and they do generate more views as a couple than apart. So business-wise it makes sense. And for that reason their relationship is beneficial in that sense. As for Jay, you got to move and it's seriously not a good look for you to cry your eyes out for a man. Be glad he showed you how he felt about you now rather later. Be glad you're not tied to him in any way. You don't have kids with him, so you get to move on and attract better. It may hurt now, but I promise you, you will get to have the last laugh. Thanks for watching, please like, comment and subscribe.